Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make home insurance animation with using Element 3D in After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and first of all, let's create new solid layer. Add the name Element 3D, click OK, go to Effects and Video Copilot and Element. So let's open Scene Setup and import select this house 10 model and click open click ok ok select scale tool and change scale like this let's change scale more and click session tool so in this time let's go to click this icon for mesh view and open inside and let's delete this part hold control left mouse click here We'll select this part and click this icon for height. Let's again hold control, click this part and height. Again hold control, click this part and height. Also hold control, click here. Let's hide this model. Okay, that's good. So in this time, let's close this inside and back to view materials. And go to presets, let's open physical and I will use this black outline. Select this material, let's use for house 10. Okay, and let's move that up. So, in this time go to create and let's create new cylinder. And go to here, we can change settings, change height and radius, change height more and move to down okay let's change view to top let's put like this for smooth cylinder change sides 150 okay let's back to perspective and change type wireframe for C segments and we can change sides for more smooth and let's change high segments and cap segments let's back to shaded nice and let's open scene materials use black outline for this okay let's back to presets i want to use black gloss let's use for cylinder and open cylinder select this black gloss go to here and change glossiness for matte texture okay so for see realistic shadows click this icon and enable show ambient occlusion very good and back to environment backlights and let's select environment image let's try use this backlight 2k also we can click this checkbox for see background SRI image okay let's hide so we can change light here i want to use warm okay so in this time select the cylinder and hold ctrl d for duplicate and move up let's change radius like this and height okay move to down and select this house model let's move that up okay we can try change a little bit scale and move to center okay not bad in this time let's go to create and select this sphere and let's move that up select scale tool change scale and Move it down. Okay, not bad. So, in this time, let's back to materials and physical. I'm gonna use this glass material for this sphere. Let's use. Okay, and open sphere model. Select this glass. And first, let's change advanced. Let's go to advanced and change opacity 35 okay and change blend mode 
screen. Okay, so let's click OK and press C and let's create camera tool, right mouse, new and camera. Click OK and we can use camera controls with these buttons. Hold this icon and we can use or we can press C for shortcut. I will use C in keyboard. Let's change view and zoom to model and move to down. Select this element ready solid layer. Open render settings and lighting. Let's select a light here warm and open ambient occlusion. Let's click checkbox for enable and change intensity 10. Okay, so open lights. Okay, let's try use Agua. So right now select this element 3D and go to world transform and world rotation and go to first second. Let's create new Y rotation keyframe and go to 10 second change rotation minus one. Let's see. Okay, not bad. And let's create new solid layer for background. Click OK and move to behind element 3D. Go to FX presses, search FX fill. Select fill, let's use for background. And change color to black. Click OK and lock layer. Okay, so select this element 3D. Let's go to scene setup. And right now open presets, environment and backlights. Let's try other lights for beautiful scene. Okay, so select this sphere and hide for now. And let's go to materials. Okay, so let's open pro shaders and tiles. Let's try use this tile. Okay, I like it. And use for this cylinder or this. Okay, not bad. Let's try this. Nice. So, in this time, let's enable sphere model and click OK. Let's close these settings and go to physical environment and change gamma like this. And exports and lighting. Okay, and let's open lighting here and additional lighting. We can change light here and rotation. Okay, let's try this Y rotation. Okay, not bad. So select this element 3D and go to scene setup. And for realistic glass, select this again glass texture and let's change specular 100 and environment 100 and glossness. Change 100 and go to down and change blend mode normal. Okay, we can change this 35. So let's click OK. Okay, I like it. We have more realistic glass and let's go to first second select this element 3D and open rotate environment and let's create Y rotation keyframe for environment and go to last keyframe change this minus one let's see okay right now we have rotate animation with environment and model select this background and control D delete fill Search effect grid and select this grid from generate. Let's use for background and change solid layer name grid. And right now, go to size form, change with slider and change slider like this. Okay, and change opacity. Nice, let's see. Okay, very good. In this time, let's select element 3D, go to scene setup and hide this glass. Click OK, change quality of full. Okay, right now let's select this camera. Let's add default field, open inside and camera options 
and let's zoom in here let's enable default field nice and aperture let's first change quality quarter and change aperture like this and blurness and select this fox distance let's search let's hold shift change for surging distance okay let's change quality full nice let's back to quarter and change aperture for more blueness let's see okay not bad and let's change like this okay i like it so right now let's back to element 3d select this solid layer go to scene setup and select this sphere let enable okay click ok so in this time let's again select the default field and change like this for inside the gloss okay very nice let's see good very good also we can try other colors for this house select this element 3d and go to scene setup So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck!